Hi guys, it's Mackie Galax here and I'm just here with a quick update on a new Cyanogen mod feature that's um, really significant going forward and that feature is the OTA update feature or over the air updater. So what this feature does is if you have a custom ROM from, I, I beg your pardon, if you have a carrier ROM from Samsung etc um, usually what they have is, or even or even the stock ROM, usually what they have is what's called an OTA updater that automatically downloads the latest um, updates for the ROM and installs it on your phone. So now you can have this feature on Cyanogen Mod as well. Um, if you flash a ROM that's uh, later than the 30th of September. So anything released on the 30th of September or later will have this CM updater feature. So what I've done is um, I've gone to get CM, get dot CM, as you can see here, and downloaded the ROM. So I already have it on here and let's go ahead and flash it. So first thing I'm gonna do is reboot into recovery. And while waiting for that, I'll just mention that prior to this, the only way to update a ROM was um, quite you know, not, not as slick as an OTA update. So you would have had to um, download the ROM either through ROM Manager Premium or download it from the uh, ROM website itself and uh, flash it in Clockwork Mod. But right now, it, you can have it automatically um, downloaded over the air and installed immediately. So I'm just gonna go ahead and flash the latest version of Cyanogen Mod Nightlies. So as you can see here, this is 2012 October 1st. So this was just released yesterday. And again, anything on or later than 30th September will give you CM updater. So I'm just gonna go ahead and flash this nightly. So this feature is really good for people who like to flash uh, nightlies. Um, and keep their ROMs up to date, right? Or, or even from one stable release to the next. So, it's just installing the update here. Just give it a moment. And then we'll pop in and take a look at what this CM updater actually looks like. And it's completely free. So the reason that Cyanogen Mod moved to this, the main reason Cyanogen Mod moved to this was because ROM updater that was previously packaged with Cyanogen Mod releases is not open source, whereas the CM updater is. So I'll go back now and reboot the system and we'll take a look at it in a minute. So ROM updater will, ROM manager, I beg your pardon, will still be useful for um, things like updating uh, Clockwork Mod, etc. But this is going to be really great for having your Sign Engine Mod nightlies up to date. Alright guys, so the ROM is done updating. And we can just pop <coughs> right into settings and you should find the Cyanogen Mod updater somewhere right here. So right in the about tablet, well in this case it's about tablet or could be about phone in your case. We can see in the second entry, Cyanogen Mod updates, and we have CM updater. So I can change the frequency with which I would like to check for updates. I just leave it on weekly now. And you can check for stable releases only, nightlies, um, you know, or or you can check for all versions, new versions. I'm just going to have new versions nightlies. You can have the ROM create an update before you actually update it. So, um, you can refresh 
right now there's there are no updates obviously because I, I am on the latest update so yeah so that's that's pretty cool um, the CM updater right here is a major major um, upgrade to the Cyanogen mod ROM so going forward it's, it's gonna be really cool to have pretty much an OTA update for the ROMs on Cyanogen mod so subscribe hit the like button and thumbs up um, and if you know you have a comment just leave a comment below and I hope to see you soon thanks